in all seriousness, was, was the first time she walked into the classroom uh, that we shared. Um, she transferred to my high school. You know, I, I've told some people before that, have, and it's, it's always the same. She, she came in and, and everything slowed down, pretty stereotypical stuff that you think of cliche, but it was all real and all in line. And I knew then there was something more about her that, without even speaking to her, that I, I had to get to know and I had to find out more about her. And not just more about her in general, but I think that there was something much deeper. And I wanted to spend as long as it took to get to know her more and, and to find out her heart. So I think I knew then. In fact, I know I did. I started to like Jeremy the first day I met him. Um, I transferred to Goddard High School from a private school in 11th grade and didn't really know anybody. I was um, coming from a Christian school my whole life, going to public school, so I was a little bit nervous. and. Only seat open in class the first day was on the front row in Mr. Collins' chemistry class and he became my first friend there and I realized he was a Christian and just a really neat guy and made me smile all the time and I was 15 and hadn't really dated anybody before so I really liked him but I didn't really know what to do about it. I knew I had liked him from the moment I saw him back in high school and I always had throughout college and God's timing just wasn't right yet and just really thankful that God brought us back together and we're able to spend the rest of our lives with each other. till 3.30 working on program, um, but just really, really excited. Uh, walking through the rehearsal dinner tonight was just a really special moment to actually play the part of what we're gonna be doing tomorrow and hold his hand and walk through the vows and the rings and just realize what a special thing that marriage is and hearing the beautiful songs that Jeremy's dad sang and Camille sang just really touched my heart how much God has been a part of our relationship and how we've seen it come full circle after, you know, the last seven and a half years we've known each other. Um, so, just really excited. Um, excited to just get to hang out with my best friend every day for the rest of my life. I went to grad school in Atlanta, Georgia, and Jeremy came to visit me last year for spring break, and we went to the zoo, and we had a, like, kind of an all-day pass that we were able to do everything for, we had all these tickets, and so we got tickets and went and rode the merry-go-round even though we were the oldest people on it and um, I normally take pretty posed pictures and he he's really really goofy and he's really helped me to open up a lot in that regard and so we took some really funny pictures on the merry-go-round or, or on the carousel and uh, I just remember that was the first picture we'd taken where I wasn't smiling and we were just goofing off and um, 
I didn't like it, obviously, because it wasn't a pose smiling picture, but it's one of his favorite pictures of us, and it's slowly becoming one of mine, too, and I'll just remember that day, because he opened, he just introduced me to opening up, you know, and not just taking everything so posed and just taking life as it is and enjoying the moment. Just hanging out and, and being alone just together and just speaking together, and, um, um, that's just where we're the happiest is when it's the two of us and everything happens there just the funny things happen that are just priceless and and the love and the, the, uh, the deep conversation and um, <laughs> there's so much road trips we love traveling and so just uh, being on the road and everything from arm wrestling in the car to you know pulling jokes on each other it's just some of our favorite things happen in, in those times.
danced We soon became good friends So it seemed That's how the song would end But we switched keys And gave ourselves an ever love and rip Friends with you For a verse or two We strolled the bridge And had a chorus of laughs Then we switched keys And gave ourselves An ever-loving and reprieve I've loved nothing else, no other person, and I've known since the day I met her. And that's never gonna change. And because of that, it makes everything else so much sweeter. Um, at the end of the day, that that will always be there for the rest of our lives. 